everybody. Welcome back to Colin's Crazy Creatures. I was in my meadow looking for snakes, and I did not find any, of course, though I did find an eastern box turtle. Eastern box turtles are also known as woodland box turtles, and they are terrestrial turtles, which means they only live on land, but they do like to hang out in mud so they can stay cool. In fact, he even has a mud ring on his shell, which means he was probably in the mud recently. They are from the eastern U.S., from Maine all the way down to Florida. They live in forests and moist meadows like here, or anywhere that is wet and muddy. You can easily tell that you have a box turtle because they have a hinge on their plastron right here, right here, which lets them close up their shell so when they retract all their limbs and their head, they are practically impenetrable. They also have this characteristic orange yellow, orangey yellow patterns on their shell, their skin, and their head, and also these very beautiful red eyes. Look at how his colors help him blend into the meadow. The only reason you can really see him is because he is moving. This guy is a male because he has a very big indentation on his plastron. He's also full size because the maximum size for a box turtle is 4 inches by 6 inches and he is that size. They also live very old. We don't know how this one is in particular, but they live between 25 years and 35 years and sometimes even up to 100 years. Box turtles are omnivores, which means they eat both meat and plants, like worms, invertebrates, wild fruit, berries, and sometimes, if they can find it, carrion, which is dead animals. When people find box turtles in the wild, they usually want to take them home and keep them as a pet, because why wouldn't you? They have amazing colors, and they're somewhat friendly. When I say somewhat, they're actually very friendly. But you cannot do that because they are threatened and it's against the law to keep them in most states. Box turtles only have a very small range of where they live, which is about 750 feet in diameter. And if you remove a wild box turtle from that air home range and take it and release it somewhere else, they have a very strong homing instinct, which will make them want to come back here, which could end up in one of the reasons why they are threatened, which is roadkill. Other reasons why they are threatened is people collecting wild ones as pets and habitat loss. Now we're gonna keep him right here, exactly where we found him. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to our channel, like our videos, and see you next time on Collins Crazy Creatures. Bye.